Hello everyone, welcome in my channel ASP.NET Core and today I'm going to show you a star rating project and uh, this is the model that is the article model. So just first of all uh, copy that class uh, in a model folder. So you can see that uh, just add a class in the folder that is in the model and uh, that is hold the ID title description active and uh, a article have a multiple article comments you may you I mean to say that uh, uh, multiple users comment on the single article so just you can say article have multiple article comments so uh, just create a new class that is article comment and uh, this is the article comment class just copy and paste uh, uh, under your uh, model folder article comment uh, and article comment have RD, uh, ID comment publish date articles ID article you can you know that okay so uh, just add both class in the data context class so just uh, add article uh, as well as you have to add uh, article comments okay so articles comment article comment and article that uh, article comments okay so after that this is the basic thing you can do in your asp.net core project and after that uh, you have to uh, use migration so add migration and the migration name is uh, related to your project that is the star rating and uh, uh, build succeed okay and update database so the table will be updated in uh, into the database into the database existing database so this is the migration and after that a view model um, just add a view model inside your uh, star rating project so have a article comment view model and in which you can see that uh, you can see uh, class article comment view model and you can say these these are the properties inside in your article comment view model our title comments comment articles id and the rating okay uh, so article comment is a list of uh, type so just list of comments and uh, comments one i mean to say that single comment which is related to the author okay so comment and articles id is an integer type and rating is also an in integer type so the next thing you can do in your project that is controller inside your controller so okay so add both uh, images under your image folder uh, inside your ww root folder so create first of all uh, image folder inside your ww root and uh, paste both images star fade.zif and star glow.zif so these are the class these are the you can paste it here also uh, the css class otherwise you have to paste in your uh, css HTML file so just copy that classes uh, these are the classes star fade and star glow and and uh, images you can see that in the um, star glow we have a url that is images okay so after that you have to uh, create a controller so article controller that is the first article control uh, article controller so just you you can use a scaffolding in asp.net core so right click on the controllers and the controller pick a uh, view using entity framework core so articles that is the model class and the controller is articles controller so just add it okay uh, so building the project scaffolding okay that is done and inside the details uh, method you have to use that code uh, where id is null uh, and just copy and uh, paste okay so just paste select it and paste it here you can see some errors if id is num nulls then uh, return to bad request otherwise article create a con uh, a single article you can find by using articles.find by id and uh, 
article comment view model create a uh, first of all object article is double equals to null that is not found article id pass id dot value article title comments just you can get the comments from a uh, list of comments you can say so comments only uh, list of comments and a con uh, list of comments get it from the database table by using uh, articles comment class so article comments dot where uh, article id is equal to id dot value okay okay so list of comments list okay comments only and uh, comments is also there hoops okay and the rating you can say that uh, also getting a rating from the article comments table by using their article id and uh, just remove uh, task and async method and you can see that ratings is getting from the article comments and rating dot count is greater than zero i mean to say that you can find the ratings sum as well as rating counts by using this method in the entity framework called rating dot sum uh, d dot ratings otherwise if it is uh, zero then assign the zero value uh, if it is uh, null okay so just controller add for article comments okay and uh, article comments model folder and okay and in the articles comments folder you have to add a new uh, external created external uh, method you have to add in the articles comment that is add that is partially uh, invoked from uh, sh uh, partial view so just add method just you have to add it inside the articles comments controller that is add article comment view model and uh, vm dot comment and article id is there vm dot rating is there and article comment okay uh, all these are uh, fields article id are uh, comments rating publish date okay so fine so you, this method is add in the articles comment class and why you can add at here so just wait it and watch and uh, okay and inside the view uh, just check a details method so just open star rating and article view is there so this is the article view uh, in the detail you can use article view model okay just copy that and paste it here you can see that article comment view model use at here and uh, rating sum rating count rating is zero rating is greater than zero rating uh, rating sum is divided by rating count uh, okay total rating is there and this that is the code model dot uh, title is there published date and the partial is the comment box okay so under the uh, that is the partial uh, class you can add in the shared folder that is the underscore comment comment box and uh, inside the partial view you have to add the partial class that is shared comments box just copy and paste in you can see that partial uh, class is also uh, use view model class that is article comment view model and in the text area you can see that at uh, comments one and uh, you can use comments not comments actually uh, is equals to comment okay so just use proper uh, editing oops yeah okay i will share the code if you want to uh, just comment it if you want to get the uh, if you want to this uh, if you want that code you can comment just under that video okay so okay text area asp.net comment and uh, article side in the form of hidden hidden also in the ratings 
and these are the C uh, jQuery files okay just use and run your code and you can see that puts of the project first of all uh, open articles and index create new article programming in C about C programming active okay in the go to the detail section and oops actually CSS class is not picked up from uh, your dot site dot CSS file so just you can use uh, under your CSS HTML file in the detail section so just copy that style under the style tag right here so in the last section you can use style tag style tag and in the site.css so you can use star dot glow star dot star glow dot star fadden dot star fat comment box input select text area body content just copy and paste inside the articles in the style tag okay so just save it and run it again and you can see that uh, the star rating project will, you can use your ratings of your project in esp.net core so detail section yeah is there so just pick hello yeah proper uh, uh, date is there and that description in the content is there and the rating is also there so Thank you guys for watching this video and keep watching all other videos which is related to ESP.NET Core. Thank you very much for watching.